Oof, I'm hungry. Okay, what am I eating? You are cooking by yourself. Cooking? Me? In your dreams? Uh, so I want to know what you're going to cook for us today. What do you feel like having? Why not noodles? Yes, it's for very common for our, for our engineers to like, you know, be cooking and then, you know, write code at the same time and then come back. How much of AI is actually integrated into this and at what levels and what steps? Like in, in simple ways. In the middle of the cooking and somebody comes and opens this. So this is like your normal sorting that you do? In a yes, place. yes. When you're stuck in cooking, you will call your mom, right? <laughs> like saying, hey, help me out here. And if you're cooking with the appliance, that's sometimes hard. So this is essentially the option we have here. That's what I was just thinking. At least you don't have the hassle of someone looking over and going like, hey, you messed up. <laughs> and then there's some salt and sugar. Oh. We're just going to hit start. Let's begin. Hello, everyone. I'm Vanna Nair, your AI roaster. I'm pretty sure like me, there are many out there who just cannot bear the hassles of cooking. But today I have someone with me who's going to show me how AI is going to solve all our cooking woes. So this is not your normal cooking demo, but in fact an AI powered cooking magic. I have with me Mehak Modi, co-founder and CEO of Appliance.ai. Hi Mehak, how are you doing? Hey brother, I'm doing well. So what do we have here today? I mean, we heard about Appliance AI, but can you tell me what it is and what's happening? So this is the appliance, which is uh, getting thousands of people today in India, uh, turning them into cooks. To cook with the appliance, we have 500 plus recipes that you will see on the screen. You choose what you want to cook okay. and you will see instructions. So it will tell you what to do. Mm -hmm. uh, you put all the ingredients at the right time uh, right. And, mm -hmm. and then you just let it cook okay. by uh, pressing the start button. Right? Uh, inside the jar, you will see that there are blades. Mm -hmm. right? Uh, so the blades have the ability to chop, cut, stir. In fact, this is one of our patented technologies that we've put in there. All right. uh, so it's the same blade that will do all of these functions. You don't have to worry about when to stop a tarka. You don't have to worry about uh, the size of onions you're cutting. Uh, the appliance will take care of all of that. All at right. the same time, allowing you to customize the recipe whichever way you want. Uh, so I want to know what you're going to cook for us today. What do you feel like having? Uh, since it's evening, why not noodles? Okay, and what, what, what are vegetables you have in your fridge? So my fridge doesn't have many things, but I'm sure I can find an onion and a capsicum. Okay, so we're going to do this. We feel like having noodles. I have onions and capsicum in the fridge. What can we cook today? So it's going to take it's going to take that input, going to scour through all our recipe databases and come up with a recipe. Okay. Um, and if it can't, it will generate one for you. The first one's chili garlic noodles. Then there's mushroom scrambled eggs. You can uh -huh. try all of these. All of these recipes are available on the appliance. So what we're going to do is we will go search for uh, chili garlic noodles. There we go. So what we're going to do now is load the recipe. Mm -hmm. You then uh, choose how many people you want to cook for. We're going to oh. cook for two at this point. Right. And uh, then you swipe up. You will see video instructions on the left oh, okay. and uh, instructions yeah. on the right. So let's get the ingredients. Oh, perfect. Let's begin. So we got what? Two red chilies, one green chili. Yep, 10 kilos. Okay, so the good news is that you don't have to cut any of that. Go straight in. My God, you made my dinner. <laughs> okay. So yeah, all right. I just place it here. And now you're going to let it cook, right? So, so you're going to hit start. press start button. Oh, wow. That's it. So it just... Yes, so it, it, it knows oh. how much it needs to it needs to cut itself. And now we're going to That's remove this. Amazing. And you will see minced garlic. Oh, okay. That? Nice. So that was the first step. Yes. So once this step is done, you can now swipe up for the next step. Okay. Okay. So now it's asking me to add refined oil, two large spoons. Right. Right. Okay. So you can measure and... Alright. Then it says yeah. crown off. So these are going to cook crown off. So this is like cooking in a kadai with the lid off. Oh. And then by... Wait. Then so start. but in a normal one, it would kind of splash and just come off. Right. No, it won't. So now it knows that it's sautéing. So it's just going to stir it gently. Oh, and, okay. Uh, and, and you will hear and you will see familiar sounds. Okay. Perfect. Why don't you start? All right. Now you will slowly see smoke and familiar sounds of cooking. So this is like your normal sautéing that you do? In a yes, place. yes. So okay. so while, while, while we enjoy some of that, what it says is capsicum, BC red, cut in four. Oh, okay. So it tells exactly like how much to cut it, Correct. how many pieces. Correct. And, and let's say like, you know, this is a confusing instruction. You can always yeah. touch the ingredient okay. and what it will do is you will now see a more detailed video of what to do. So, so now that okay, the capsicum... You have roughly cut the capsicum. I hope I did a good job. Yeah, 
rough cuts are all you need. The ma major cutting will happen inside. Awesome. And uh, then we're going to do the onions. You, so you can also you can press this button. There's a weighing scale. So oh. in case in case you're not sure about the size of the onion, you can just weigh it here. And that's 68 grams. I think this is good enough. Plus minus 20% okay. will be fine. Okay, perfect. Um, it just says cut into four. So roughly so, cut it into four. No, uh, so one thing, Mike, what I love the most about cutting this is I don't have to go into the oh, finely chopped good. one and I don't have to cry. So that's perfect. E exactly, exactly the point. Like just roughly cut and it Okay, goes so I in. can drop it in. Yeah. Okay. yeah. Right, and now we're going to hit start. Okay. So you will, oh. you will hear slightly different sounds. The normal, the chopping process and stuff. Okay. So now you see, these are as you would have it in chili garlic noodles. Oh. Okay. Like a different size of cut, right? So okay. it's going to say, skip the balls again. So we're going to do that oh. really quick. So it gives you a step-by-step -step instruction. Yes, okay. yes. Oh. If you follow it to the T, nice. you, you will guarantee great food. Amazing. And uh, you can keep modifying things along the way as well. All right. So we will so then the next swipe step, up right? again. And then we're going to saute it, right? We're just going to hit start. And it's going and to start cooking. And it's showing four minutes. It says so cook crown off, so the crown's off. Now you look at these traditional things. Right? You have a lot of these mixers, grinders, who kind of, I mean, which kind of does this uh, chopping and everything. So this is more like, you know, a certain size and you have smaller versions and machines. Wouldn't a person want to say use that versus something? If you were to cut this in a, in a mixer grinder, for example, you can't cut it in different sizes like you see here, right? Everything, it'll mince down. Mm -hmm. Now the other thing that you can do is, you don't have to stand here holding this. Right? Yeah. You can just like basically hit the start button, do okay. something else, come away, 100% safe. All right? right. So that's uh -huh. one, of, one of the things. Like in fact, middle of the cooking, if somebody comes and opens this, it will just pause on its own. Right? Just oh. see, pause. Okay, that's so, fine. So yeah. all of this safety is literally built in. You hit resume and you can cook. And, and, just and when yeah. we said we want to build Netflix for cooking, this is one of our hidden features, right? You cannot pause cooking normally. Yeah. But over here, you have the ability to just say pause. Yeah. It will just hold the food where it is. It will decide whether it has to keep it warm or not, and then you okay. can come back and resume. So you have a call in the middle. You exactly. Have I was just like, someone rings the bell, and you're like, "What do I do? Do I switch it off and run?" Like, yes, yes. So yes. I can pause it and go for. Yes, it's for very it. common for our for our engineers to like you know be cooking and then you know write code at the same time and then come back. Uh, uh, you will okay. you will hear the appliance in the background a lot of code reviews. <laughs> Great. How much of AI is actually integrated into this, and at what levels and what steps? Like in in simple ways. There are two aspects of our AI. Right. One is the the hidden aspect where you know it decides how much to cut, when to stop. Uh, over here also, it's sorting. It is aware of uh, what is inside. So, for example, uh, if you put less oil than recommended, it is going to slow down cooking automatically. Mm -hmm. If you put more oil than recommended, it is going to cook faster. Again, very uh, normal thing. So, the easiest hack, okay. like in all cooking, if you want the appliance to cook faster, you just put more oil in. Okay. But why would you? Because yeah, you, right. it's going to do the cooking for you. Let's say we want to go to the next uh, next step. Mm -hmm. It says add dark soy sauce, tomato ketchup and vinegar. When you're stuck in cooking, you will call your mom, right? <laughs> like saying, hey, help me out here. And if you're cooking with the appliance, that's sometimes hard. So this is essentially the option we have here. That's what I was just thinking. At least you don't have the hassle of someone looking over and going like, hey, you messed up. <laughs> exactly. Yes, the appliance is always there to help. Uh, right. In addition to this, we have an extra thing where you can, if you're really, really stuck at the air, I can't help you. Yeah. There's a call me button here. You hit the call me button, we connect you to a chef direct, right? Like, so you can oh. be like, hey, I'm cooking this, this is what has happened. And you you can you can get whatever you That's want solved, awesome. right? And uh, wait, one question, is that 24-7 available? Uh, it is 10 a.m. to 9 p.m. <laughs> right, I remember that. One large spoon dark soy one sauce. Last, so that's one large spoon. Okay, we have half a spoon, that's going to be cool. Okay. Vinegar, one, one small spoon. This is the vinegar yeah, and then, then we will finally do the ketchup. Ketchup, which says one large spoon again. There you go, one large oh. spoon of ketchup. Right? Okay, uh, three steps done. Uh, and then there's some salt and sugar. Oh. Uh, the last step involves uh, just putting in the noodles. So, uh, okay. we're going to see, let's see if we get lucky. 96, nice. 400 grams, close enough. Close this enough. goes straight inside. Okay. And Perfect. we finally need 360 grams of water. So we're going to hit this button as well. Mm -hmm. And finally, I think there is some butter. So there was butter in a bag. Yeah, and we're going to do this. I will use this to put in the butter. So weighing, weighing is typically optional. You can essentially go in and yeah, I think uh, it estimate it. Yes. And we will okay. do that. So now we will start. And I will put this back in. Okay. And you can hit start. Okay, so it shows 
14 okay all so right. four and a half minutes later you're going to have some chili garlic noodles okay. um, so all the steps that you did were the steps that you would do on a kadai anyway but uh, at this point of time you just need to walk away it once it's done it will stop it will send you a notification on your phone and uh, you can come back when you want uh, oh so it's connected to the phone yes. you're getting notifications stuff yep that's perfect that. yeah so you don't need to walk around you can just walk away That was the sound of completion. Yes. Okay. So it's done, right? Yes. So we're done. We should have some chili garlic noodles in here. Awesome. Can't wait. Yeah. To plate, all you do is you can put the whole jar out. Then you can put in that. Yeah, so it it looks amazing. Like you're just in a restaurant and you just ordered your plate of chili garlic noodles. So just been waiting for this. Hmm. Very nice. So this has got the whole. I'm getting that whole, you know, home food kind of vibe. At the same time, you got all the ingredients that you know you get in the hotel. And and and, and that's the intent, right? Uh, food is always homely. Yeah. And uh, you will also see like like the capsicums cut differently, the garlic cut yeah. differently, which will give you uh, different textures as you eat. Before we move on, would you want to rate the chili garlic noodles? So yeah, that yeah we have of some course. Feedback? Oh, five stars. Great. Okay. So, awesome. uh, this goes straight to our team uh, and. Uh, now once you're done cooking yes. what you could do is you can press the rinse button and then say rinse what it will ask you to do is add some water mm -hmm. little bit of detergent and then there's a start button so water oh. detergent and okay. then you say start so yeah, if you want perfect. to cook things back to back it's uh, it's exactly like a mini dishwasher uh, that's uh, nice so you just pour it out and then that's it right yes. the cleaning process amazing and what next for appliance.ai i mean what any new features that we can look forward to so we're just getting started we are we are now working on more ai features uh, you know where you can directly talk to the appliance uh, modify recipes faster and on the fly so there's a co-pilot coming up uh, we have meal planning options coming up we have integration with uh, you know quick commerce so that you can not only like you know uh, cook the food with the appliance you can also get the ingredients at rapid pace a lot of features uh, like this coming up uh, we have a lot of health focused uh, features also uh, on their way where you can choose how many recipe how many calories of food you want to cook yeah. instead of the portion size uh, we are also working heavily on uh, low carb and uh, low oil recipes all right all right perfect mike there's lots going on so yes guys so thank you so much for tuning in uh, until next time so bye bye bye, -bye.